Education is a universal right. Unfortunately, girls are still the minority in schools in low-income countries, accounting for more than half of the children who do not attend primary school. Approximately 75% of girls throughout Ghana attend primary school. However, there is a significant drop in the number of girls who attend secondary school and college. Our future growth relies on competitiveness, innovation and productivity. And these in turn depend on the education of our young girls who hold the destiny of our nations. I was very excited when I heard about this initiative. I thought, wow, very refreshing. We believe in empowering women in the 21st century because they play a key and a pivotal role in the development process. And that is why we identified girls from these underprivileged communities who can be empowered digitally and technologically so they can uh, become problem solvers for their communities. This education gap can be bridged through the active development of females by introducing them to STEM-related programs, especially in the field of ICT. When I was called by Dream Mobile to head this project as the technical head of the project, immediately what came to mind was, okay, if we are going to train girls, it would be best that girls or females or ladies train these same ladies. So outright, I sought to put together a team of the brightest, smartest, um, most committed IoT ladies I knew. Fem ITI is a project which trains young girls to develop problem-solving skills through coding and robotics to empower them to facilitate technology creation. I think that the choice of Mamubi Nima girls is a very good one because it portrays to other children that no matter where you are from, you can do just about anything you put your hands to, especially IT. Next time if the program is coming on, I think or I wish the equipment to be enough for every, each and everybody. The foundation believes Fem ITI is an initiative that will advance gender equality and empower women and girls. If we fail to address the differentiated needs of girls as well as their aspirations, a generation will be lost and with it, our hope for sustainable development, prosperity, peace and security.